Um, 100% cotton t-shirt that's been soaked in soda ash for at least 20 minutes and then spun out until it's just damp. I have marked the center lines and it is inside out since it's being ice dyed and I'm going to go ahead and um, set it up for a symmetrical fold down the center where you pull the sleeves through each other. Uh, I do have a video specifically for just this part. Well, there we go. We'll just start over. All right. I need to do it from the side of the shirt, not the center of the shirt. Okay, that's better. I'm really glad I caught myself before I went too far into this. going to, f oh, what was I going to do? Oh, that's right. It's going to come off of this and mark one inch. Some people do do this with a protractor. But I looked all around the house and I couldn't find a protractor. So, we shall do it this way. My center isn't very good on this back part, so I'm not sure how well that's going to hold up. But anyway, okay. Go ahead and do the sinew on this. Okay, I'll do this side since this is easier. And do this part. I really don't like doing this part of these. I get really sloppy because I get tired.
it's probably as good as it's going to get. And I'll say it's probably better than I normally do if you watch me. Okie dokie. Mark this out. inches, I guess. Right. Okie dokie. Time to tie this off. Okay, I'm going to try and keep these flat. You know how hard that is to do so that it doesn't pucker up. Lightly do that, and then we'll come back over here. And start doing this side. that wasn't straight. Something on here isn't straight. I guess these aren't. Oh well. We shall do this anyway. Again, I don't know if this is going to work. I have a feeling it's not. We shall see. Off to die. Alright. Just ignore this one over here. We're going to go with two colors. Dharma's Tangerine and Cerulean Blue. At least we're going to start that way. I don't know if... Yeah, I, I think that's what we'll do. Alrighty. Through. Okay, I've put it in an aluminum boat just so that I can do this part. This is Raven Black and it's mixed as a liquid. We're just going to pour into the base. And it was heated. It was about 110 degrees or so. And I just want that to wick into the bottom. And we'll let that sit until time to wash out. Okay, it's been sitting for... Uh, actually, I don't remember when I did the liquid. Overall, it's been probably 36 hours, but I don't know which step. I was, that's from the beginning. Let me get rid of this black. All right, let's take a look. That's upside down. Throw that in the wash and then take a final look. Here's the finished design.
I was fully expecting to see a lot of green. Um, even with that one, uh, what, two inch section, one and a half inch section, whatever, that I left without any color. But there's the teeny tiniest little bits in here. So that worked out really well. Um, I probably would have preferred um, something other than cerulean. And I realized, even after my last order from Dharma, I only have like three or four blues. That's, that's it. And not any that have really good splits. Now this tangerine, this tangerine that they offer is the perfect fire. Um, it splits into yellow, orange, and red. You don't have to have yellow, orange, and red. You just ice dye with it and you magically get yellow, orange, and red. It's awesome. It gives you fire on any shirt you want fire on. Look at that. I mean, come on. That makes it simple. Okay, would I do the black again? I don't know. I was expecting the black to fill in. Uh, I don't know. I probably should have left it out. It probably would have looked better if it was just uh, the blues and the, the tangerine. Maybe. I don't know. What are your thoughts? Do you think it would have looked better without the black? If you're interested in the shirt, it is an extra large, and it will be out on Etsy. Uh, it may or may not still be there by the time the video posts, uh, just depending on how things work out for the timing. But if you're interested in it, it may be out there for you. Uh, let me know your thoughts and any ideas for future videos, and until next time, thanks for watching.